Good evening. The latest news and sports headlines now from ITV Wales. 500 people have turned out at a rally in Milford Haven in support of the local Coast Guard. Local MPs were among those speaking at the event. Milford Haven is one of Britain's busiest ports and plans to close the Coast Guard station has brought widespread condemnation. Jane Solomons reports. <laughs> A rally cry to campaigners today. 300 people came to protest against the proposed closure of Milford Haven Coast Guard. This is a town built around its coast and shipping. Many face losing jobs. They had support today from the Environment Minister. May this fight be won on behalf of the people of Wales. The government is proposing to close Coast Guard stations to save money and create a networked National Coast Guard. In Wales, Hollyhead and Milford Haven would close. 24-hour cover would come instead from a centre in Southampton. I don't think that you can make a small saving and put large numbers of lives at risk. And that feels to me very strongly what this consultation will do. Uh, it is quite clear from the strength of feeling here today that people feel that the Coast Guard services, which are very, very small in terms of expenditure compared to many other government programmes, should be kept on. It's 15 years since the Sea Empress ran aground here, spilling more than 70,000 tonnes of crude oil along the Pembrokeshire coast. Coast Guard say their experience can't be replaced. You cannot replace local knowledge. You cannot make 220-odd people unemployed and still retain the knowledge that they will leave behind. The consultation time for the government's proposals has been extended until May the 5th. More people will have a chance to express their views, but the Coast Guard service still has to navigate some pretty rough seas. Jane Solomons, Wales Tonight, in Milford Haven. The Environment Minister, Jane Davidson, has joined a rally in Milford Haven over plans to close the town's Coast Guard station. Holyhead could also close, leaving Wales with one base in Mumbles near Swansea. The UK government says it's extending the consultation on the proposals. It doesn't feel to us uh, at the moment that Wales' needs have been taken into account uh, because, of course, we're talking about uh, removing Coast Guard services from Holyhead, removing Coast Guard services from Milford Haven and uh, uh, demoting the Swansea services uh, to a daytime service only.